Some things only work when they're hit on. One of them is a special sort of crystal that yields electricity when squeezed. These piezoelectric crystals can be found in lighters for kitchen stoves, in machinery for baby ultrasounds and in sonars used by ships to measure water depth. But researcher Beatrice Nojeda of Groningen University wants to use them for something different, generating energy. For example, you could use piezo crystals in a dance floor, which will generate electricity while you dance. Not enough to light a whole city, but you could certainly power the dance floor lights. A bit more useful would be using the crystals to generate energy in spots where it's not so easy to use an extension cord. Within a car tire, for example, where a tiny sensor measures the air pressure. Using a piezoelectric crystal, you could use the tire's vibrations to power this sensor. Or maybe you could use piezo crystals to power a pacemaker, making use of the thumping of the heart itself. However, there is one problem. The best available piezo crystals contain lead, which is poisonous and ecologically harmful. So Beatrice Nojeda wants to find piezo crystals without lead, which are just as good or better than the lead-containing ones. So why does a crystal generate electricity when squeezed? The crystal itself is built out of positive and negative atoms. If you push it hard enough, these will shift with regard to each other, and this shift yields an electrical current. But you can also generate electricity when you don't exactly compress the crystal, but when you squeeze it, as if emptying a toothpaste tube. Beatrice Nojeda discovered that this can give you more electricity, especially when you lay together the tiny crystals in this way. So now she's dreaming of using that idea to develop a better piezo energy source without the lead.